What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today I got a super sick video because I got my homie Memo here. What's He's also on, another shooter. He has an A7S III and he also has the Mini 3 Pro today. So today we're gonna do a sick comparison where we're gonna be comparing the Mavic 3 versus the Mini 3 Pro and see how the footage goes. So yeah, let's get it. Let's get it guys. So Memo, why'd you choose the Mini 3? Like. So I chose the Mini 3 mainly because it's super compact. I found myself last year mainly going on a lot of hikes and stuff like yeah. that. I feel like. And I felt like going for a bigger drone would kind of, you know, it, it'd be kind of backbreaking if that makes <laughs> yeah. any sense. So, kinda, you know, yeah. I kind of wanted to go something a little more compact and something that was a, a little easier, you know, to get through and, and start flying. Uh, the only disadvantage I've seen so far with the Mini is just, you know, the lightweight. Um, yeah. There's sometimes when I'm shooting and it's a little more windy. True, yeah. So it, it kind of moves a little bit. A little it's shaky. not too bad, yeah. but it's, you know, you, you notice it if you really look deep in the, in the yeah. video and stuff like that. See this thing? If you guys don't have this, you guys got to go get it straight up. <laughs> yeah, this seems sick. Because like other people, they're like, oh yeah, I like the convenience of the phone. But for me, it was a disconvenience because it's yeah. like, it's like you gotta fucking pull it out. Maybe your phone's dying, you know? And oh, it's and like, then, and then on top of that, the phone calls and yeah, stuff like that. Yeah, people just... be texting you. And then also the brightness goes down too, right? Yeah, when brightness. it gets hot, yeah. bro, like it fucking goes down. And it's like, it's a piece of shit, but like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. this thing's dope, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Shane, you got extra sticks here too. Yeah, yeah, Upgraded the guy the that I bought it yeah. off, he gave me um, some extra stuff and yeah, like the cover yeah. and then some red. Uh, this is pretty stuff. sick, yeah. Like, right. I, I have the RC Pro. I'll, I'll show that to you yeah, in a second. Yeah, yeah. It's like the legit version. and. Mine has like um, HDMI out, yeah. so it's good for pro shots because then like yeah. if people want to hook up a monitor and stuff. Yeah. I don't have to use that too often, but it's just a good feature. 100%. But yeah, I mean, this thing's pretty sick. It's like, yeah, it like is, a budget yeah. RC Pro. But the big difference between the Mini 3 Pro and the Mavic 3 is this one has the adjustable aperture. So obviously you could do like F2.8 to F11. This one, you can't. The only thing you could do is either pop on ND and then crank those shutter speeds. So it's another big difference. Yeah. All right guys, so for the Mini 3, we're gonna adjust some settings real quick just so we can match them up. Let's do video mode here. Um, let's shoot 4K24 on this one here. We're gonna do d -cine alike And then um, white balance, we're gonna change to 5600. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there you go. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna launch my shit. So yeah, basically the idea for the videos later, I'm just gonna compare the shots. So okay. I will try to match shots. So yeah, let's, yeah, let's do one where we just yeah. like kind of, let's do a reveal over the mountain. Okay. All right, so for the video, we're just gonna do some different shots with the Mini 3 Pro and the Mavic 3. We're going to try to match shots, you know, get some cool looks together. And then later we're going to compare the footage and really pixel peep, see how different the footage is. So on the Mavic 3, I'm going to change it to 4K 24 since that's the same resolution on the Mini 3 Pro. And yeah, I'm going to be shooting in D-Log since he's shooting on d Santa like So let's check it out. Two, one, action. Yeah, keep going over the mountain. So we'll go a little higher. Yeah.
All right, let's get, let's just get a push in around there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of go around you. the curve. Okay, ready? Want me to go lower? That's fine, yeah. All right, ready? <laughs> Do you want to go like, cinema? You. want to go to cinema mode? I'm already on cinema mode. Yeah, okay, me too. To? Okay. Ready, set, action. Yeah, just follow the road. Yeah. All right guys, so for this next test, we're gonna test out the low light of the Mini 3 Pro versus the Mavic 3. We found this really cool spot right here and we're just gonna kind of fly it nice and low and see how the low light performs on each drone. So let's try it out. You're gonna go all the way to that hill? You think it'll make it? Mine can, yeah. I'm not sure about yours. <laughs> All right, launching. <laughs> I'm up the hill. Oh shit, there's all the people over there. <laughs> uh oh. My connection. Shit. <laughs> connection shit? Yeah, it was, yeah.
<laughs> so that's the conclusion of the video. Later, we're gonna compare the footage between the Mini 3 Pro and the Mavic 3. And the Mini 3 Pro, obviously it's a cheaper drone, but there are some benefits because it has that vertical sensor. He got some super sick vertical video, vertical pictures. And yeah, we had a ton of fun today. And later we're gonna see how the different results show. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thanks, Memo. Good shit, yeah. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>